Life cycle costing is a method used to determine the total cost of an asset or project over its entire life cycle. This approach considers all costs associated with a project, including those incurred during design, construction, operation, maintenance, and overhaul. In the context of PPPs for infrastructure projects, life cycle costing is a crucial tool for assessing long-term financial viability of projects and developing technical solutions that offer the best value for money. By considering all costs over the asset's life cycle, life cycle costing allows project stakeholders to make informed decisions about design, construction, and maintenance that maximize cost savings while maintaining quality. For example, a road project that considers life cycle costing may use more expensive but longer lasting materials in the construction phase, which can save money over time by reducing maintenance costs. Life cycle costing can also help ensure that infrastructure projects are sustainable by accounting for environmental impacts and long-term social and economic costs. To illustrate how life cycle costing works, let's consider an example of a road project. The government of Rivertopia is considering two options for a new road, one that uses traditional asphalt pavement and another that uses alternative concrete pavement that's more expensive but longer lasting and requires less maintenance. Using life cycle costing, the government of Rivertopia evaluates the costs of both options over the road's entire life cycle, including construction, maintenance, and eventual replacement. Rivertopia would consider factors such as the cost of materials, labor, energy, and environmental impacts, as well as the expected lifespan of each option. Rivertopia might also consider the social and economic costs of traffic congestion and road closures, which could be minimized by using more durable concrete paving. Once the government of Rivertopia has evaluated the costs of each option over the asset's life cycle, it can make an informed decision about which option is the most cost-effective. In this case, if the life cycle cost of concrete pavement is lower than that of asphalt pavement, the government of Rivertopia would choose the concrete paving pavement, even though it has a higher initial cost. In PPP infrastructure projects, life cycle costing works similarly. Competing private sector bidding teams evaluate all costs associated with an asset over its life cycle. They bring in expertise in innovative design, construction, and maintenance techniques, and work towards the technical solution with the lowest possible life cycle cost in net present value terms, while still meeting all the performance requirements. By accounting for all costs, PPPs can ensure that infrastructure projects are financially sustainable over the long term. Life cycle costing is a crucial tool for enhancing the long-term financial viability of infrastructure projects and ensuring that PPPs deliver value for money. Learn more at our PPP website, www.cldp.doc.gov/ppp.